condition that we are. All our problems, all our needs, all our wants. Help us, Lord, to hear from you and listen and obey the leading of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So, so that we could be able, Lord, to have the breakthrough with our prayers. To have a breakthrough in our lives. This we ask and pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, brother. That was a very wonderful message. I hope may nakuha tayo doon. Amen. Hallelujah. Um, Let's have our benediction, Pastor Bing. Hallelujah. So that the message that we hear, that we heard, is all about God's promises that rest on His children, on those who believe in Him. You must remember that the Bible itself pertains, points to three audiences. The Bible, the writings in the Bible points to the church and to the believers, especially the New Testament. It does not it does not apply to the people who don't who don't believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. A New Testament, ang mga writings sa New Testament yun ay nagpo-pointan, yun ay para lamang sa mga naniniwala sa ating Panginoon. Pero karamihan yung, yung mga nandoon sa Old Testament points out to those unbelievers also. Kaya make sure who is in your heart. Is it the King of Kings or the Prince of this world? For everybody is a spirit. We are a spirit living in a body with a soul. Yung soul natin, yun yung ating emotions, character, conscience, frustrations, disappointments. So we are spirit with a soul living in a body. And when we die, the flesh will come back to earth. But your soul and your spirit will still live and live eternally. Amen. Pero saan pupunta? Saan pupunta ang spirit mo and your soul mo? There are only two places where your spirit will go. It will go to hell or it will go to heaven. For death is but eternal separation from God. Ang kamatayan ay hindi katulad ng ating paniniwala na mamamatay ka na lang, gano'n na lang, wala na. Ang ibig sabihin ng kamatayan ay walang hanggang separation, walang hanggang separation from God. And if you are separated from God, then who do you belong to? To the devil himself. So choose life. Choose God. Alam mo, God loves us so much, even the ungodly, that He is doing everything in His power for the people to come back to Him. Ang lahat ng paraan, ginagawa ng ating Panginoon Diyos sa mga hindi naniniwala sa Kanya. 
inilalapit niya mismo ang kanyang sarili upang ang mga tao yung dinaniniwala sa kanya ay magbago ang loob. Ginagamit niya, pinahihintulutan niya ang mga nangyayaring hindi kaaya-aya sa buhay ng mga tao upang sa huling banda sasabihin ng tao, Lord, suko na ako, hindi ko kaya. Kailangan talaga kita. Hindi kaya ng aking sarili na labanan lahat ng mga problema ng ito. Limitado ang aking kakayahan. My power is finite. I only need you. And if you need God right now, you only have to say a prayer. But you have to say it sincerely in your heart. Say that you will turn away from the ways of this world, from the proddings, na ang lahat ng nangyayari sa buhay mo ay kagagawan ni Satanas. Because we are imperfect ourselves. There is no perfect one. And we are living in an imperfect world. And we are living in an imperfect circumstance. But we need a perfect God who loves us. Who will care for us. Who will save us from eternal hell and even the disappointments and the failures that we have even right now. It is the Lord Jesus Christ himself who has said, I am the only way, the truth, and the life. Nobody will come to the Father in heaven except by me. Except through me. It was also said, seek God and His righteousness. Not your own righteousness. His righteousness. For He is a righteous God. The God that sent His only beloved Son to death. God Himself murdered His own Son. So that we in this world should live and live for Him, to worship Him, to honor Him, to be with Him as a family, as His child. We are His child. And you are His child. And He's been knocking at your door, knocking at the door of your heart. Come to me. Open that door. Open your heart to the Lord Jesus Christ. And he will have supper with you tonight. And throw him. And see the glory of the love of God in the face of our Lord Jesus Christ. And may the wisdom, the spirit of wisdom and revelation be with you. So that you will know the power and the love of God that belongs to you. Amen. If you are that person and you need Him and you want to follow Him and you know that you cannot rely on your own strength, you only need to surrender yourself to Him. Say, I need you in my life. I need help, but only you can help me. If you are that person, say this with me. Say this prayer with me sincerely. And God himself is your audience right now. Even right now. So bow down your head and pray my Lord Jesus Christ my Lord Jesus Christ I need you I need you 
I want you. I want you. I cannot take care. I cannot take care of my own self. Of my own self. I am a sinner. I am a sinner. And I will die. I will die because of my sins. Because of my sins. But your love for me. But your love for me is everlasting. And I come to you now. And I come to you now. Forgive me of all my sins. Forgive me of all my sins. Forgive me of all my iniquities. Forgive me of all my iniquities. Save me. Save me. I want you. I want you. To be my king. To be my king. My lord. My lord. I enthrone you. I enthrone you. In my life. In my life. As my savior. As my savior. From now on. From now on. I will be with you. I will be with you. You will be with me. You will be with me. You will draw me nearer to you. You will draw me nearer. And you will show me the love of the Father. The love of the Father. I will be blessed. I will be blessed. I will be eternally forgiven. I will be eternally forgiven. I will be a highly favored child of God. I will be a highly favored child of God. Lord. Lord. Accept me, accept me as one of yours. As one of yours. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 And amen. amen. If you have prayed that prayers sincerely in your heart, know this. The angels in heaven, even God the Father Himself, is dancing over you. Amen. In joyful, joyful joys. Hallelujah. He loves you and He cares for you and expects good things to happen. Amen. You have been born a new creation right now. Amen. Amen. See life in a new way. Because God is with you and He will never leave you. Amen. The Holy Spirit Himself is a guarantee that you belong to God himself. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So let's raise up our hands.